I'm the iPhone king, no jobs. I got this iPhone thing on lock. I'ma start making tutorials. How to make a goddamn pop. Here we go again. Changing rooms. Next day, I went to the front desk, complained, told him about the stains all over the place. Told him about how many times I switched rooms, which would be the fourth time. And um, they understood. So they're going to upgrade me, as they should. You know? you know what I mean? I realized how much weight I've gained. Weight. You know, this is parental weight. This is weight that you don't really consider because you're a parent. You're too busy raising other people. You care too much about other people. But in turn, you stop caring for yourself. It's called gross negligence. Hold on. Hello? Hello, Mr. Bautista. This is the front desk. Did you need the bellman to come now? No, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna bring everything to the front desk and I mean, I'm gonna bring everything uh, when I pull up to the car and then we could go from there. Okay, thank you. I just wanna know if he, he's waiting here, but Appreciate if you don't need him anymore, you're good. <laughs> Appreciate it. Thank you, Thanks. bye bye. I spent so much time caring about other people that I kind of forgot to take care of myself. And I'm paying the price for it because, man, I don't like to say this on camera, but I feel so unattractive. I hope women don't find me unattractive. Shit. Leave a comment below if you find me unattractive. See, here's the thing. To anyone who does have kids, you know what it's like. To, but for those who don't have kids, it's like you just don't care that much. I mean, you care just enough to get by as long as you don't. Some people totally let themselves go. But I kind of did too. I know exactly who I am and what I can do. So it's not a midlife crisis. But I'm having a moment of reflection. How could Colin Batiste do such a thing to himself? I'm talking about back fat. I'm talking about love handles. I'm talking about fat stomach. How could I do such a thing? All these years of negligence. I was speaking to my homeboy. He said, bro, on the low, you kind of had that big pudgy belly for a long time since you started dating your wife. Really? Okay. They put me all the way at the end of the hallway, but I have a feeling that's a good thing. You know, you got like, it's crazy when you got like the extra door to the door. Oh yes, much better. Oh, much, much better. Oh yes, by far, way better. Better closet space. I don't know what that is. We got that too. Oh yeah, oh, the door to the bathroom. Oh, yeah. yeah, the door to the bathroom. I didn't, okay, 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 it's cute. All right, this is a cute, cute. Okay, all right, okay. Much better. And we're going into the, uh, the, the, the apartment, the living room. Oh, man. Oh, they gave me the double. Oh, they gave me the double. Oh, wait, oh, the two balconies? Wait. Oh, I get to see. Wasn't I over there just shopping just a minute ago? Oh, wait, and then they give me this huge TV. Look out, the TV, you can see my whole body in the TV. Wait, and that's the city? I, I get to, hold on. Oh, I get to walk outside and see the whole, I was over there yesterday, hold up. Wait, that was the old whack hotel over there. I get to see all these buildings in the, oh. Kids, I have to say this. If you have a dream, you go get that dream. <laughs> Where there's a will, there's a... Uh, you get what I'm saying. I'm about to go eat some steak. Oh, man, I feel good. I feel good. They hooked me up. It's not supposed to be. Anyway, all jokes aside. I'm at Cheesecake Factory, even though it's recommended that I don't go here, and they messed up my order. I had a steak, I have, I'm getting a steak with some salmon, so I don't know, it's pretty good, it's pretty good. But they messed up my order and they offered me that cake. And I swear to God I wasn't gonna eat cake, and I'm gonna change my diet. 
But, man, you saw that cake, right? Okay. It's been an hour since I've been waiting for this food. Over an hour. A cheesecake factory in Utah. I'm just letting you know. It's been over an hour. They ran out of french fries. And I think they went to the store to buy some. I want them to give me like two steaks. And two salmons. That'll make up for all of this. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh. Mmm. They don't call it Cheesecake Factory for no reason. Wow. Unbelievable. I'm gonna go up there. I'm gonna go up there in the mountains. Let's see what it's like. Let's see what it's like in the mountains. I'm gonna go up there. You ever been in a cloud? You about to be in one now. So these are what the streets look like. It's just straight uphill. Straight uphill. Well, at least going up these mountains. I like this place. It it got like a cute vibe to it, like that house right there. And then you go down there. It got very cute vibes to it, man. I, I dig this place. Um, we're gonna bring the family out, so when they come, that's gonna be the real. You know, Jennifer's gonna, you know, nah, she. Well, you don't know, but I do. She, she, she's very uh, picky with her scenarios and situations. But we almost at, you know, I think, man, we over here chasing clouds, man. I'm chasing clouds. See that cloud? See that cloud right there? That's what we going for. We going for that sucker right there. We, we are going and chasing clouds. I pray to God we could enter one of these clouds. That would be kind of cool. Showing the YouTuber. YouTuber chasing clouds. Wow, look at those houses up there. Those probably some NBA players or something. Those houses. But that's where we need to go, right there. Let's see if we can do it. Road closed. Yeah, we going up some more then. Oh, yeah. We just keep going up and up and up. We, man, I don't know if you can see behind me, but we just keep going. This is like... Dang. I gotta open the I gotta open the window. She's really and my ears popping. Sheesh. We we going really high, y'all. I don't believe people oh uh, I don't believe people really you can feel the elevation, the blood in your head or the oxygen. It's quite different up here than it is down there. A little more airy. I guess that's why they call it airy. But we literally at the top of the mountain. See, they go to the mountain top right there. We chasing clouds in Utah, baby. There's nothing else to do but chase clouds over here. They all look all slanted houses type. Oh, they go to the mountain. All right. I think I'm gonna go that way. Let's 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 make it. You can see the clouds on the floor. I don't know if you can see it. I don't think you can see it. Oh, we're in the clouds. For a city boy like me, this stuff is exciting. You know, like little weird stuff like this, but the top of the mountain baby i know I mean, at least we made it they might be chasing they might be chasing uh clouds also it's crazy to see a top of a mountain all the way down there and we're just at the top yeah, that's crazy to me uh, those guys on the on the roof are at the mountain yeah we're in the cloud hey we made it we are in the cloud y'all I know you probably can't see it, but we made it to the cloud. I could at least say I came, I saw, and conquered nature. <laughs> no, I'm just joking, man. You ain't conquer no nature, man. It's all. But either way, it is good to know that I, I, I made it to the top. Oh, we're in another cul-de-sac. Look at these cribs. And just so you know, I wasn't faking jacks when I said I'm in the cloud, because you really can't tell. We up here. That's that's the cloud. That's the cloud right here, and we're in it. 
so I made it. I stick to YouTube, it's like TV.